Monday again. Um, this is uh, yeah, the start of week two in earth moving. So I've been put on a job where I've got to spread a bit of rock around a shed slab. Um, yeah, we done the earthworks a few months ago, so the cut inside of it, or the cut into the side of a hill. So yeah, we're back here after a few months to spread some rock. Uh, yeah, no, we'll get down to it. I might be able to take a few photos or videos We're working around some other people, so yeah, don't wanna, yeah, don't wanna disturb them too much, but yeah, that's, uh, that's the start of today. Quarter to 12, Monday. Um, so I've basically wrapped up this job now. I had to spread that rock, had to clean up a bit of scrub. Uh, some branches and whatnot the owner cut down and I've just chucked it on this pile here so at the moment waiting to be picked up so I can go get the truck um, and I've got to pick this posse up depending on where we're going next but uh, yeah it's pretty much this job done quick yeah, quick job for the morning I think it was about four hours four and a half hours um, uh, yeah so yeah, just a quick tidy up and yeah, go pick up the truck so I'll uh, check back in when I've got the new new game plan. Won't be next job. Um, get her unloaded and get into it. All right, guys. So it's 5:40 at night. Um, still on a Monday. Where still? While well, I'm still on this job, that uh, yeah, well, the second job for the day, and we've got about one more truckload that's got to be taken away. Of, uh, of the fill or the rubbish or whatever they had here so um, yeah we're working on into the night but uh, yeah we're still still gonna pack it up um, pack it up take it back to the yard which is probably another half an hour so I might not get home till about seven o'clock tonight so yeah it's gonna be yeah, gonna be a long work Work day slash night. All right, guys. So it's Tuesday morning. Uh, at, uh, seven o'clock in the morning. So I'm on my way down, down to the yard. Uh, 
got to pick up like one of those thousand litre water cubes if you know what I'm talking about. If not, I'll try and show you. But, uh, and the pressure cleaner, so the 24 tonner we had on hire that's uh, going tomorrow, so we're going to clean it up and there's, there's just clay caked everywhere. So yeah, that's where I'm on my way to now, so we'll uh, check back in after. footage and just tried to wrap it up before but my camera was giving me problems so um, yeah ho hopefully if I'm back there tomorrow I'll get some footage of what I, what I had done today so yeah anyway for now I'm going home morning guys it's uh, 701 Wednesday morning so if yeah, yeah. And a bit of bad luck now with the weather. Looks like for the rest of the week it's all going to be pretty dark. So, well not dark, but yeah, going to get a bit of rain. So, it's sort of going to stop us in our tracks. But lucky, today is probably the last day we need anyway for this uh, dam project. So, yeah. Yeah, that's probably about it. I'm uh, jumping in the loader. Jumped in the loader. Um, spreading a bit of topsoil around. Grab the uh, wall of the dam. It's on the big grass eventually.
guys that's it for another day see all the dam liner in there all the topsoil around the edges so yeah it's uh basically what we've achieved today well, the dam liner had dam liner went in uh yesterday and the day before but yeah putting the topsoil around that was today's task so yeah you know we'll be back here in the morning So it's 10 past 11 on uh, Thursday. Yeah, didn't get much footage this morning, but basically what I'd done, I had to go pick up one of the little fuel bowsers on the back of my ute, uh, take it to another job, fill up the dozer. Now I'm here and uh, yeah, I've jumped in the machine, so the five tonner, and we're doing a bit of a spoon drain all the way up a driveway. Uh, and still got a bit to go. So the truck is out uh, getting a load of rip wrap that we're going to put in here. So the whole idea of that uh, is to sort of slow down the water and uh, stop the erosion when it's coming down the hill. So we'll be plucking that out of the back of the truck with the bucket and laying it down in the in the drain. So. Yeah, no, hopefully we can get out of get out of here by today because I think we're expecting a bit of rain soon. So if we can knock it over, I think we'll all be pretty happy. So I'll try and get a bit more footage after. All right, so got the spoon drain dug out. There's uh, where it leads down there to the culvert, if you can see that. And it goes all the way up the hill. So I'll uh, track up and see what I do, I'll fast forward it and see you at the other end. So this is where we've got up to with the rib wrap so far. Um, that's two truckloads worth. So we've probably covered about uh, what's that, maybe 50 meters. Um, we've estimated maybe another four or five. So yeah, there's a fair bit to go in. It will be shaped but our priority at the moment is to get it in in case it does rain and it'll uh, yeah, stop a lot of the erosion. So, yeah, that's, uh, that's where we're up to at the moment. All right, so we're done, done here for today. Um, Still got to do a little bit. The quarry where we get this rip wrap, they run out of there, you know, run out of it. So we've just done what we could. We're gonna have to come back and finish that off. So yeah, other than that, we've still got a fair bit done. But um, yeah, at the moment, it's five o'clock, so that's about a day. Day done for us. So we're just going back to the yard and unload the machine and yeah, home time. So I'll uh, be back in the morning. All right guys, so we're back here at this job where we ended yesterday. Turns out the quarry, uh, they had more of this riprap. So yeah, we got a call, but it wasn't until like quarter past four, so couldn't do much. But um, yeah, anyway, so just unloaded. The truck's going to get its next load. And uh, yeah, so we'll jump back into it for a day. All right, guys. So basically, finish this job now. Took an extra, what was it, two or three loads? I think it was today of the rib wrap to fill in the drain. So I've just uh, I dished it out or created a bit of a V shape um, in the drain. We sort of recommended putting it level that way in case someone drives over it. It's not gonna wreck their car, but the owner wanted it sort of dished. So I've just been working on that. Um, 
doesn't look too bad. It's just, and it really it probably won't affect it too much if someone does drive over it. But um, yeah, no, pretty happy with how it turned out. So just going to load up the machine and take it on back to the yard. And I think it's going to be going to be an early Friday for me. So pretty uh, pretty wrapped with that. So all right. Come on, guys. And